let's say you wake up tomorrow morning and you're like, oh my God, my head hurts so bad. I've got this massive headache. I've got a really bad migraine. I need to go to urgent care to get some medication to solve my migraine because that's what you think you need. It's going to be probably a $75 copay after insurance. I need another $25. Okay, i got a $100 budget. I'm going to go to urgent care. I'm going to get the medication. It's going to solve my problem because that's what I think I need. Now, you get to the doctor's office and she starts asking you some very pointed questions about the pain and what the pain feels like and how long you've had the pain and what the pain's doing to you and what the pain's preventing you from being able to do and other questions. And her questions start to get you to think or really feel that you might have a way bigger problem than you originally thought you had. And then she says, we might need to do a CAT scan. And you do a CAT scan and it comes back that you have a tumor in your brain. And not only that's a terminal tumor. You've got 60 days to live. And the solution to solve that problem to remove the tumor, the surgery is going to cost $2 million. Your insurance only covers 80%. Well, let's say it covers 90% just to help you out. So now you have a budget of what? $200,000. Now you know what you what? You need. But you didn't know what you needed before you, the doctor talked with you, did you? See, that's why you can never sell to just the needs of the prospect. You have to sell to the real problems that your question ability allows you and them to find.